Today, we're gonna to take apart a Honda CX500 carburetor. As always, I'm gonna show you how to do it with just one carb and the rest being identical, you'll have to do on your own. But first, let me show you which tools you're gonna to need. There'll be a number of Allen screws, so obviously you're gonna need a set of Allen wrenches. We'll need a long M5 screw, a number two Phillips head screwdriver, and a number of regular screwdrivers of varying sizes. A small metal hook fashioned out of a paper clip, a seven millimeter wrench, a thin little spike, and a powerful little flashlight. Let's get started with the float ball. We don't have to take off any kind of choke because on these older models, the choke consists of a series of flaps within the carb itself. The float bowl is fastened down with three Phillips head screws and we're gonna loosen and remove them. Once the screws have been taken out, then the float bowl can be carefully removed. And this is what the cover looks like. And as you can see, it's gonna need a new gasket, which we're gonna do in the video where I reassemble the carb. 